Good morning. Hi, everyone. This is for the parents. So we decided to go and walk you through a tutorial as to what we do for our circle time activity. The first one that we do is we check in. So what we have at school is we have a name tag and a picture with our students. Each of our students has one. We ask them to come up. We ask them to say good morning or hi or whatever their ability is to say to us and then they put their name up on the wall. You might not have that at home, but I'd like you to make little cards with your child's name, not everybody's name, just your child's name so they can become familiar and continue to recognize what their name looks like. After that, we do two songs and you will see that in our um, kid presentation. The kids will be able to show you all the movements. They know them very well. They do. After that, we do calendar. And the way that calendar works is we talk about the days of the week. We talk about um, what the date is. We also talk about the month. We do not typically talk, uh, sing our songs for the months of the year, but some of your children know it, so I am going to put that in as well. Some of them don't know it, and that's okay. After that, we talk about the weather. Our weather looks like we sing a weather song and then we dress a weather frog. I do not expect you to have this at home, so your modification is going to be, if it is like today, snowing out, they need to get their winter hat and put it on, put on their winter coat and zip it up. They might need help starting the zipper, but each and every one of your students or your children can take that zipper and zip it up the rest of the way on their own. They do that at school, so that's awesome. After we do our weather, we do a movement break and you can find anything online that is any type of movement or happy fun song. We'll show you an example and please look out for the kid version of our circle time. Bye. Bye.